going on my youtube family and uh back with another video so today's topic is really exciting uh, we actually got some eggs from this pretty girl i'll just get right to it uh, she's definitely on the smaller side uh the camera's not uh, picking her up because it's nighttime over here but she's like a high orange um she's just gorgeous she's glowing she's very beautiful <clears throat> albino anaconda yeah albino anaconda no other hits She's about 160 grams when I paired her. Um, I fed her until she got huge. And um, uh, she, she never stopped eating up until the point where she laid her eggs. The day the day before I tried feeding her, obviously, uh, she had too many eggs inside and she was about to lay. So uh, we got 10 beautiful uh, pearly whites. And uh, she, she gave us one slug, which... Uh, we're really happy. So that's about a 91% rate for healthy eggs. They're actually in there right now. Um, we have them incubating at 27 degrees Celsius. 20 here. Let me check real fast. I got to get up here. 27.1. 27.1. Um, that's about 82-ish, 82, 82 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah, we're super excited. So a little bit about the history and my story. This is going to be our first time uh, having hognosed babies. Hopefully, everything goes right. Everything goes well for us. And we're able to uh, breed our first clutch of hognoses. We're over the top excited. The kids are over the moon. And um, it's just really exciting for us. Um, I'm not going to lie. Last year, we slugged out. And we weren't able to... Uh, produce any hog noses so uh, trial and error I think it was my fault I didn't feed the hog nose enough the 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 female and I think that she just didn't develop the eggs I don't know that's just my theory but trial and error I learned from my mistakes and uh, I'm really excited so this beautiful girl right here she's uh, she did really well for us I did a feeder I fed her about a 16 gram mouse um so next year, we have a whole bunch of good stuff coming. Basically, our whole racks are going to be in action. Uh, we're going to have, you know, all kinds and all kinds of morphs, including our Swiss chocolate female. She's going to be ready to breed for us. Um, Arctic, Arctic Honda hit Swiss. Uh, we'll have um, just corals, moonstones, super Arctic toffees. I got a, a, I have a couple surprise uh, females there that I have I don't think I've ever shared <laughs> and then um, yeah so this is the male for the the pairing um, he did excellent he did excellent so he's like again the lighting in here is really poor but he's a uh, yellow um, he's in he's a yellow super conda um, hit coral so he's got hell albino hit lavender so all the babies are going to be uh 50 possible lavender um i'll have some super conda albinos i'll have some anaconda albinos and um maybe have 100 percent hit albinos so i'm really interested to see how the polygenetics are going to play out and uh that's all i have for you guys i am sorry this is kind of a short video i've been taking a break from social media just because it could get overwhelming, you know, it could get overwhelming and um, just want to take it easy, guys. Uh, it's really easy to obsess over, you know, um, social media and uh, and um, Instagram and stuff like that. I, I, I found myself checking it like every hour, every every other minute, basically. And I was like, OK, you know, this is getting out of hand. So I did a, a break habit. I did like a seven day break habit and I was able to get off of it. I think I don't know how long it takes to break a habit, but it, it took me about five days to uh, break that habit. And now I feel free and I'm happy. So once in a while, I'll be posting on Instagram. I check it once a day um, and I just wanted to share with you guys the eggs. Um, so this is our first clutch. Unfortunately, our other females... Um, uh, they did uh, show a lot of interest, but the males just uh, didn't, or I don't know if it was the males or them, but they just weren't able to get it done uh, for whatever reason. So I'm going to have to look into it. Um, and yeah, so thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, uh, leave it in the comments and 
Uh, thank you guys so much for your support and everything. Until next video, I'll see you guys.